what's your business here? My question exactly. You've been in touch with Cece for a month. Why? Oh dear, it must have been hell to pay. But he does adore you so. Every word is music in his ear. You've threatened him with something, haven't you? What is it? You've been up to your old tricks again, haven't you? You intercepted my letters to Mason. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh yes, you do. That was always first among your many award-winning talents. That and your silly telephone hijinks. That's why I smartened up and stopped calling. Well, that was to be expected. All's fair in love and war, and you wanted to keep me away from CC. But why did you want my son? You owe me, lady. I raised him. No one asked you to. That's right. And it had to be done, and there wasn't anyone else around to do it. And it wasn't easy. Oh, boy, did you see to that, languishing on the fringes of things all the time. With your delicate health. And your drinking problem. And your intermittent, ridiculous lavender mail. You bet your bottom I didn't let him see those letters. Because they weren't fit for a ten-year-old boy. Filled with dark threats. Veiled accusations about the terrible things that I did to you. The terrible things that his father did to you. And what Mason should do, what Mason should say, and what Mason should send you. So you felt it was better that he thought I'd abandoned him. I gave him a feeling that he had a family that loved him. And I loved him enough for ten mothers, and I'm very proud of what I did. I gave him a brother and a sister that looked up to him. And I fought to keep peace between he and his father. And I saw him through the loss of a woman that he worshipped. What did you ever do for him? What did you ever do for anyone but yourself? I came back. Well, I don't know what you want from us, but you're not going to succeed. I have spent the last six months with that sick daughter of yours and her revenge, and I am still more than a match for anything you have planned. I drove you out of this town one time. Oh, and I can do it again. You'll never do it again, Sophia. You stole one family from me. I want you to know that I'm here, and I'm here to stay.